Hey everybody, it's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is about the color sensor maze. So my students actually designed this maze, pretty cool. Um, this is our FLL board, um, but I use, just use painter's tape and they actually helped me design the maze. So the object or objective of the robot is to only use your color sensor to hit the color to trigger your turn to make it from the start all the way to the finish. So from the green start here to the green finish right there. So the robot would have to maneuver through each color and basically you can't have your robot's wheels touch the blue uh, painter's tape. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you real quick uh, the program. Uh, not the entire program, just the first three blocks to make the turn because the program's really long. Um, but as soon as you figure out the first turn, you should be able to figure out the rest of the turns. And then I'll actually show you the robot uh, going through the maze. So let's go to it. Okay, so I've opened up my Lego Mindstorm software to just a blank template for a program. So like I said, I'm just going to do the first three blocks and let you guys figure out from there uh, how the rest of the turns would go. So when we are on the start block, what we want to do is just grab this move tank block and what we want to do is just turn it on and then um, I tell my students to drop it to a low enough speed so that it gives their color sensor a chance to pick up the color so I told them to drop it to 30 um, 50 is fine that, that means sometimes that's a little too fast depending on the their color sensor and you know where they have it and it could um, does it pick up the color good enough so if it's speeding past the color then I would suggest turning down the motor speed so that is going to get us to a color then we're going to go here to this orange part or the blocks and then I'm going to pull up a weight block and they are using the color sensor so I tell them to turn it to color sensor to compare to color now the first turn for our maze I don't know if you remember or saw it was yellow so we're going to check yellow and uncheck red so right now our robot will go forward in this block. It will go forward until it sees yellow for this block. And then we want it to turn. So um, I you can make the robot turn you know, a bunch of ways, but I just, for me, I prefer just having the robot turn with one of the large motors. So we're gonna be making a left turn which will cause us to just move the C motor. And then I have that, now this is where I let my students decide, well, what are you guys gonna do? Are you gonna do seconds, degrees, rotations? Uh, my students seem to prefer degrees, but you know, whatever floats your boat. So I have my students again, slow that, that turn down. It doesn't have to be slowed down. But here is where they can mess with seconds, degrees, or rotations to figure out what's going to be the perfect turn to send them towards the next color. Now, the beauty of this is, is those are the exact um, three blocks you would use for the rest of a maze. So if you're heading for the next color, you just do everything and repeat it. So we would drag this up again, turn that on, drop it to 30 again. Bring that same weight block up here. Color sensor, compare color. And the second turn was red, so sweet. I don't got to touch that. And then your large motor again. And we'll connect that with the data wire. The next turn is going to be a right turn, so I know that's going to be motor B. And then I just change that for the next uh, turn. So my students will just keep doing those same three blocks, turn after turn after turn, until eventually they can get to the finish line. So that's a, it's a pretty easy program. Not easy to experiment and you know adjust the turns. My students are having to go back and fix the turn, make it less, make it more until they get it perfect. So that's the program, guys. Hopefully that was easy enough to follow. Let's go to the video now of a robot actually making it through the entire maze. All right, guys, I am Mr. Hino with Machino's Lego Robotics. Check out the video, but after that, I am out.